Today we're going to show you uh, how to use our screen printing. Just the viscosity of it, how the residual shows. We're just going to do a very simple demonstration with a spatula. That ink that we just dipped our spatula into is yellow. And as you can see, when you put the yellow just directly onto the t-shirt, there's really no color. And you don't have to add a lot of the ink in order to show any color change. So you just take a very small amount because our inks are very concentrated. And with one very thin layer, we're just doing it, you know, not very professional, but one very thin layer of ink just to show you somewhat of the technique of the residual and um, the color change effect. That color there was blue and it uh, there's different blues that we have, different greens that we have. This color that we're doing right now is our black color. And you can mix these colors within each other too to make other colors. And um, as you can see, again, it's a very thin layer and you really don't need to use a lot of ink. This is not going through the drying process, obviously. So you're not going to be able to see how you know colorless the inks are. But if there is a, an ink that has a residual, the best thing to do is to take the um, artwork and put an outline around it. Now we're going to demonstrate just maybe mixing two colors, which you should actually mix the colors together first, but I'm just laying them on top of each other just to show you what the effect will be. And this will give you a different color change. So again, the inks are very concentrated. You don't need to use a lot to get great color change and um, very thin layer, one pass, 230 to 305 mesh. And we will now take it outside. So now we're just showing you that there is a little bit of residual on the t-shirt because obviously there is something wet that's laid down. This has not gone through the dryer process yet. Now we're gonna take our t-shirt outside. So as you can see, there's still something laid down on it. But as you get closer to the door in the sunlight, a little bit of color change starts to appear, and that's not even direct sun yet. But then watch how quickly you walk right into the sunlight and bam, color change completely. As you could see with the bottom one, if you were to have mixed those two colors together, you would take the yellow and the green and, and you would yellow and the blue and you would have a green color. I didn't mix them thoroughly. As you can see, we wanted to do a very quick demonstration. But you can see the depth of the color change, and that's the whole idea of this video. So solar active inks are uh, in 26 colors. They're phthalate free and environmentally friendly and very easy to use. Call us for some information at 818-996-8690 or visit our website for more details. Thank you.